Hello, hello! How's it going, everybody? Who is already in here? Welcome in, and welcome back to another stream. We are once again back to play some more video games. And we're gonna see how this one goes today. But it's good to see everybody both on, on Twitch and YouTube. Hello, hello. Laid back to camp, thank you for the two years, man. Squid Socks, thank you as well for the 32 months. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. So what the hell are we playing today is a good question. This is a difficult game about climbing. I mean, literally, it's called that. It's made by the legendary video game developer Poopy Pants, as you can see in the bottom left corner. Essentially, we climb. If you remember, uh, there's games like Bennett Foddy, kind of like those where... Difficult controls, very precise, and, like, one mistake can basically end it all. I mean, there's literally a rage quit button. So, we're going to see how it goes today. I've been seeing a lot of people play it, and I thought uh, it might be kind of interesting, since I've kind of, I've played, like, all those, like, other ones, like, Bennett Foddy, kind of like that. So, uh, I, I thought I kind of wanted to try this and see how it goes. I have seen nothing about this, other than a couple people playing it. Uh, somebody was doing a speed run, and you know what? It looked easy in the speed run, so I'm probably gonna kill it. So it should be fine. I'm sure it'll go fine. All right. Now I am playing on a control. Now I don't know if it's better to play on a control or a uh, the mouse and keyboard. I guess we'll try both. Uh, let's see. Do we have any controls? It just says grab with triggers and then move hands, and then that's it. That it, those are the two things we got. Okay, so our right analog stick moves that. We can also swim, by the way. I noticed that before I started, too. So maybe if we want to, we can swim away later. Yeah. Oh, wow. So we actually have, like... So we do that, and then go there, and then right hand. Okay. Okay. I kind of... Can I grab onto the green one, too? Okay. Oh, so you could, but it's real slippery from the looks of it. Okay, I got that. Probably don't want to... Let's grab onto the... There we go. That. Alright. I kind of see how this... This... Dude, climbing is easy. Alright. There we go. Oh! Not all the way down. Okay. We don't have to go that right side, though. So momentum actually does matter, even if you break your arm while doing the momentum. Okay. Now, I bet there's going to be, like, secret ways that you can go that are, like, the easiest to, like... Wait, can I grab onto that? Holy shit, I did. Okay, so I could also do a fucking dare... Wait, can I... This might be risky, right? I'm going to see. Can I jump... Huh! <laughs> I mean, I can. I just I didn't make it that far. All right, there we go. It doesn't seem that bad. The controls are actually okay. They're not too terrible. Cosmic permanence. Thank you for the five dollars super chat. You're on the toilet. Well, this is perfect toilet entertainment here. Don't worry, I'll be up before you finish. Let's hope you take sixteen hour shits. Okay, so you can kind of, it's a little not grippy, but you can still climb onto the rocks that are kind of wet. Oh, shit. <laughs> you can't be too hasty. I'm pushing too much to try to get over that jump when I could just get on the edge and take it slow. I'm testing my limits with, with baby falls, you know? Because if we fall later, it's going to be a lot more... Oh, a lot more painful. Yay! There we go. This is a weird video game genre that was, like, made. Where you just, you just have kind of... 
weird controls where you had to be like very precise and if you fuck up you fall all the way to the bottom and like restart your progress it's a really weird video game genre okay let's put get your right arm over there there we go Ooh, can I get up there uh no oh I don't think my limbs extend that far. That's fine. The shoulder is meant to break. So you can kind of wiggle. Any true rock climber will tell you that this is a normal technique. Okay, maybe I'm not ready for that just yet, though. We ain't ready for that, for that type of move yet. No! Oh. By the way, what happens if I fall and I hit my head in the bottom? S somebody's gonna get really hurt. Sada Haru, thank you for the 17 months, man. And Cosmic Permanence, thank you so much for becoming a member of the Church of Cookie. I appreciate that very much. Uh, Sinister Vortex, thank you as well for the 34 long months sub. And welcome in, everybody. Hey, Ark, what's up, man? Welcome in, everybody. Just joining on in. Hopefully, everybody's been having a, a good one today. Okay, maybe if I just let one analog stick control. So my right analog stick controls my right hand. My left one controls my left hand. Maybe in a way that'll make more sense. Okay. It's not bad. All right. Grab it. Is that enough to grab? Yes! You know what would make this game shit if they added stamina to it? I don't know why I just thought about that. If you had some type of stamina system, that would make this game so much more difficult. Uh oh. I heard a crack. Oh boy. I gotta get to that rock. Maybe I can just kind of weasel my way up here. Oh, I do need to be on that right side. Look at that. Alright, we gotta... Almost. Oh, okay, that's dangerous. Ooh! That worked out beautifully. Okay, hold on. Let me get... Let me use my shoulder as leverage. We gotta... Make our way up there. Oh, I'm not getting up from this side. I need my left hand. There we go. Uh-oh. Just... Slightly out of range. By the way, why is he wearing like a little underwear? What What is up with that? How did he get into this situation? Who am I? Maybe that's the real question. That's what we're asking ourselves in this story. Who is this guy? Oh, I thought I got the rock. Oh, okay, hold on. Let me see. Is there another path that we can take here? No. Okay. Help! Is it too late to ask for help? Maybe they could still send somebody. By the way, yeah. Imagine how much this would actually hurt. Your fingers would be... Nubs by the end of it. Nubs down to the bone. Oh! Okay, hold on. 
If I go uh, like up and then down, that makes it go up pretty high. We gotta get on the first one though. Nope. Uh oh. We're losing it. <laughs> yes! What's this? Is there a gas thing up here? Oh, shoot. Okay, so I need to grab onto the actual edge. I see. Grab on with your right hand. On the... There we go. Okay, I'm on the edge. Oh! Wait, hold up, I'm cooking. <laughs> I can grab onto this, right? <laughs> Wait, hold <on. laughs> There we go. It's telling me to go that way. What? Which way? Um. Help? Oh, shoot. Wait. That's not it, is it? That's where I was, right? Oh, God. I might trust it. Ah! <laughs> okay. Um. Oh. Oh, no! <laughs> He slipped on his own. Ah, oh, that's not bad though. That was pretty good. We we hauled our ass up there for a bit. So, I don't know if he has like a certain amount that he can like hold on to, and then he like falls or. Oh, you can almost get up there. You can almost reach. So close, yet so far away. So close, yet so far away. Maybe I can grab onto like a leaf and climb my way up there. Oh. Look at my hand like trying to reach. Please, it's there. I thought maybe I can use like my leverage and kind of make my way up there, but I don't think I can. Yeah, maybe momentum. Let's see. I lost all my momentum as I was building it somehow. It seems impossible, but I did. Uh. Okay. Whoa. Just drown me, for Christ's sakes. Uh, Eddie Tombstone, thank you for the 23 months, by the way, man. Okay, I kind of see how the game... I see the gist of it. You think our character even has nails anymore? I wonder if you use both hands to push up. I don't think... Huh. 
<laughs> I'm slowly making my way lower. <laughs> I'm certain you can get up there. I just don't. I don't have the skill to do that yet. It's all about rhythm. Listen to the sound of his groans. Oh, dead. <laughs> I hit a, a pineapple down there. Slowly, but surely. There we go. Upsa daisy. Oh, got it. Raise your hand up. Up. There we go. No. What's the ending? You get to see like his ass or something? Uh, Thorn Veil, thank you for the 35 months, man. I already got cursed by Auric. That was fast. Okay, maybe I need to stop trying to go that way. Nice. What? He gave up, I didn't. You guys, no rage. It ain't gonna happen, okay? In life, guys, why do why do we fall? You know, when we're trying to climb rocks. What? Why do we fall? You know, I've only gone rock climbing once in my life. And, uh, it was exactly like this. I wore a little, uh, little thing on my waist exactly like his. Just, uh, they kicked me out. I didn't get to climb. Mine was a lot smaller than his. A lot, oh my, a lot smaller. It was it might as well have been a napkin. I was not allowed back inside. Okay, we got a good grip on that. There we go. We gotta get a good grip on this branch. There we go. I hope the... I don't know if the branch... Um, 
if the branch is bad, like in terms of like, does it fall? Or will I be Gucci to put all my weight on that branch? Let's hope I brought walnuts. Oh shit. Oh, thank you Kratos, I appreciate it, man. I'm glad the vids could help out in any way. Carefully. Careful. Let's get as far to the edge as we can. Whoa! Did you see that cool trick? That was sick. Oh, I see. There's. I think that's why I fell last time. There's a couple of like parts on the rock that are slippery. Okay. Oh shit! I might need. Me oh boy. Oh god, is that gonna work? I don't think that works. Maybe on this one? No! <laughs> ah, my hands already kind of fucking hurt. And I ain't even talking about him, I mean on my, me in real life. We all know Prod loves edging. You better be talking about rock climbing. Prod, am I- are you a weeb? No. Ignore the fact that I'm wearing a Jujutsu Kaisen shirt literally right now. What- in fact, I don't even know what anime is. I found it at, uh, this is Balenciaga. Jujutsu Kaisen merch. It was made by Sir Balenciaga himself. What? I don't know why I kind of like the sound of the water. I'm curious, actually. If I keep going, you think there's another way to start climbing that's not this one way? Oh, shit. Oh. Oh, wait. No, I can't climb there. Never mind. Have I made a video of Dragon's Dogma character creator? No, today on this stream, at the end of the stream, we're gonna be doing some some character creating. I got it downloaded on PlayStation. I want to try it out. Okay, I'm starting to realize that momentum doesn't work super well in this game. At least not the way I'm doing it. Am I thinking about making an abomination or a beautiful abomination? I kind of want to make my Dragon's Dogma 1 character, which she was pretty cute.
Okay. Almost. Okay. I think that part where it's like yellow, uh, and that other area with the danger sign, that's my first obstacle. That's my first real t challenge. Here, low, low ass up there. This this one's kind of hard too. Almost. By the way, what have people been playing this on? Mouse, keyboard, or controller? It's kind of hard to get that one sometimes. Is there... Wait. Is the thing... Is that where I just was on the right? It is, right? Yeah. I was like, can I jump early? Get your little bald ass up there. No, 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 no. <laughs> ah! Okay. Calm down. Calm down. Okay. Whoo! <laughs> I do actually really like doing that. Okay, I'm curious. Is there... Oh, that's just where I was down there. Okay, there's nothing there. Can I climb out the dinosaur bones? That's what I used to tell my teachers at when I went to the Natural History Museum. This is like that picture of the guy who's reaching his hand out to try to touch God. Let me see if I can get momentum to swing that way. Okay, so if I start climbing, I lost all my momentum. Fuck, I'm slipping in there. Okay. Arc got timed out again by Cookie. <laughs> Have I seen the trailer for Arc Thrones? I did, yeah. It looks fucking sick. We'll for sure be playing it on the channel whenever it uh it becomes available to everybody. Okay, time to try this again. No, 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 I haven't even tried it. Oh boy. Okay. Yeah. 
Huff! <laughs> it's... Dude. I need to see how to do that one. Fuck. That's a tough one. That's the hardest jump we've had so far. 100%. If we can do that one... Oh. I also hit my leg on the way down. I'll never be the same. Saw an eight minute speed run of this at your pace. It should be there in about six hours. Hey, well, it took, it probably took them 50 hours to uh, even learn that speed run and get it that good. So give me about 50 hours and we'll see where I am. And then you can judge me. Man, I probably won't even be up there in 50 hours. I'll be dead in 50 hours. I guess this is a good way to know, right? I should probably never go uh, climbing the side of a mountain. Okay, there we go. Sorry, I have T-Rex hands. T-Rex hand syndrome? Ever heard of it? I love doing that. I think that's my favorite part of this so far. Oh! No, dude. I didn't even get a try. Ugh, fuck. That one's tough. Oh, thank you, Botan. I appreciate it. And hey, Ballistic, and I'm doing all right. Peaks of Yore. Have I heard of this? It sounds like a horror game. Does falling count as gravity? Excuse me? No. Guys, we fall so we can get back up. I feel like I'm pressing the triggers on my controller so hard that I'm going to need a new goddamn controller after this.
Patience. Never mind. What do his fingernails look like? What if his whole hand is a fingernail? Then he'll be good. Yeah, there's definitely, uh, you get a nice little boost if you're going fast. I don't know if you can make that yet, but... For Miyazaki! I couldn't do it for him. Oh. <laughs> I like how he just goes, whoop. Oh, so close to getting up there. Why don't you like... Is there anything... No, I'm, I'm in a bad spot. I was gonna say, is there anything left? Keep fucking up my momentum. Okay, now we're getting stuck on this rock again. Oh, we can kind of. Not do that. Come on, you bald bitch, get up there. My hand's right there. <laughs> Aww. Why can't I get up this one little rock now? Uh oh. Don't worry guys, no no rage. I'm just I'm pointing out that the this rock's mom is a hoe. Smooth sailing from here. Here we go. Here we go. What amazing grip strength this guy has. Ah! 
Okay. Momentum, right? Momentum? Momentum. Oh, I fucked it up. I fucked it up. Momentum is the name of the game. Actually, it's a difficult climbing game. Ah, oh, I didn't want to give it. I didn't want to do that. Oh, fuck. Okay, if I jump, that might work if I go like that sideways, actually. Oh, it's so dumb. It's not gonna work again. <laughs> oh, fuck. I don't want to do it. Okay, fuck it. Ha! <laughs> oh, that was so stupid. I didn't even go I don't think I went a single inch. How much is gas prices? Look how much they've skyrocketed. I tried if I if I went fast that would maybe get in there but nothing. Oh my I'm telling you my hands are gonna be sore after this. You might not think it's that bad, but dude. Kinda hurts your hands. Now imagine his hands. That's why I choose not to complain, because I imagine his nubs. Cloud 9 district, think of the 34 months, man. Now, I'm definitely not against, like, seeing how the fuck people are getting up there to make my way up there and see if I can copy it. But we'll keep giving it a- we'll give it a couple more attempts where I try it on my own. Will this be a video on YouTube? Probably, yeah. Like an edited one? Oh, 
trying to reach with my right hand? That's not how climbing works. Oh, fuck, I was too far to the edge. Hey, free creature, what's up? Hey, Mariana, what's up, man? Right, we just gotta slowly. <laughs> okay, maybe not that slowly. It's just a matter of time before we get good with the other jump too. We just, well, we gotta get it once first. Once we know how to do it once, it's game over. I'm flying up this goddamn mountain. Pulling out the leaves on such a beautiful plant up here. You think it's poison? It's poison ivy. So every time my hands pass by it, they get itchier and itchier. I think that ex people do that in real life at a real climbing move. They dolphin dive off the mountain like that. Oh. Whoa! Fuck. Oh. Well, it, he has such a weird sense of gravity. My man has all the gravity on his head. Maybe that's what makes a great climber, though. You can tell Miyazaki didn't make this game because those feet go completely unused. Why well, he's paralyzed. He fell in a climbing accident. Oh, that's why his center of gravity is entirely on his hands and his head. He's paralyzed. Fuck, 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 ah! <laughs> Fun fact, fish don't have eyelids, but sharks do. Huh. That's an interesting, uh, tidbit. Check the water wheel. What, this thing? Why did you want me to check this? Yeah. 
What the f Oh. How did I do that? I need to do that, but for the other side. You see? We're oh, shit! That was fucking sick there. <laughs> Oh, I'm practicing my jumps. That's why I threw myself, because I was like, fuck it. Both hands? Oh, let me see. Let me do a little bit of a practice while I'm on the ground. Because it's almost like that high, right? Oh, okay. So if I, like... Throw myself upwards like that. But you don't go super far. I feel like that's what I tried to do last time and I didn't really go too far. What about like this? <laughs> that might actually get me to the to the other side. That's pretty sick. Hey, Talon, what's up, man? And I do remember you, man. What's up, dude? Pretty sure you were the guy that had the really good voice, right? I'm gonna try that double handed jump on the other side. This is the moment where I never reached that peak again. Oh, it's good to hear that, Talon. It's good to hear that, man. Great quote. Wait, what's the quote? Can I climb on here? I don't have to jump on the nipple. <laughs> what the fuck did I say that? Oh, that must have been when I was playing only up mod. That sounds like a only up mod type of quote. Oh yeah, we can try our double handed jump from here like this. Uh, that might work. Hey, it's good to see you too, Talon. All right, let's try this shit out. Oh boy. Yeah. No! Oh. Woo! I touched it though. I touched it. That's the start. It's a goddamn start. Watch this. Ho! Oh, oh, I fucked that one up. <laughs> Thank you. 
An aquatic biologist scientist after 48 years of studying fish decided on his final thesis that in fact fish do not exist. <laughs> he, hey, he might have a point though. Have you ever really... Hey, think about it. Have you ever seen a fish in real life? Fuck. Okay. I need to not be so hasty. Gravity works, so, you know, if you fall from a certain amount of distance, you're going to be heavier. Therefore, slip more. I think that's uh, Einstein's theory of relativity. By the way, did Einstein win in Oppenheimer for best uh, best actor? Bro came back from the dead and didn't win an Oscar. Einstein never played Dark Souls. Maybe he got an early copy from Miyazaki. Here we go. Back again. Fuck. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Should I get closer? Maybe I should do it from this one. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. Ah. Fucking zero momentum. Oh my god, dude. I went less than an inch. All right, Talon, have a good night, man. Watch Jeff play this and he lost his shit. Well, I'm not doing that here. I am a... I'm... I'm what you would, you would call a Zen person. And... Um, I I have a, one of those little gardens in my house where you, it has the sand and you got a little pitchfork and you have to... Uh, like, you can move the pitchfork to the sand. I buy all of Goop's products, including the vagina candle. It, one of them did explode in my face, but you know what? I said, that's probably the candle's squirting mechanics. It's features. I thought it was a feature. Yes, my nose burnt off. It happens. I need to practice my jump that I want to do. Yeah. 
I think I'm just... Fuck, I just don't go far enough. Hmm. Said to me, thank you for the 26 long months sub. I appreciate that. Jared, thank you as well for the 38 months. Show the clip from Dark Souls 2 Soul Level 1 DLC boss. Which Dark Souls 2? Which, which boss? Ah. I jumped wrong, I think. I might have to watch a video and see how people are getting that. Cookies on a rampage timing everybody out today. Get up there, you shit. Oh, I saw his hand go over twice, too. Oh, fuck. I thought I made it up. I wonder if that sound gets anybody nervous. It's kind of like the, a little bit like the sound of like the nails on the chalkboard. You should try it on a real mountain. What, play this game on a mountain? Why would I do that? There's no internet connection up there. I don't think I'd be able to get a, a, a electricity up there to play this game up there, so. That's a foolish idea, honestly. Me, thank you so much for the two months here. Three as well. Much appreciated, man. Thank you. Trying to see how I can get some momentum. Hey, Zura. Why is there a dinosaur bone up here? 
Somebody called an archaeologist. We found the dino. All right, I want to see how people are doing that part. I'm having a hard time with that one. I just want to see an example of somebody doing it. So I'm gonna look it up. Uh, difficult climbing game. Let's see. All the speed runs. Okay, my god. Let's get a quick look at... My god, by one minute, this guy's far beyond the point where even I am. Oh, he took that path that I, I said I couldn't... I didn't know how to take. Okay, that's interesting. Here, let me show you guys. Pop it on the screen for everybody. Oh, wrong one. So this guy is, he just does it with the one hand. So obviously, look, like, the, he also gets up here, like, pretty easily. Maybe we should try that, too. So momentum looks good. He doesn't even use momentum of climbing in that situation. He just kind of swings himself up there. Maybe we'll try that as well. Same goes for here. He doesn't really use momentum. Who swings? So he swings with his left. He grabs on with his left hand and then swings to grab it with his right. Okay, I see what he's doing. He's kind of going like, like left and then up. We'll try that. Am I mainly on Twitch? Yeah, I'm streaming on both right now. Alright, let's try it again. I want to see if I could try making this. Oh, okay. All right, hold on. I got too far down. Oh, I grabbed onto uh, uh I grabbed the, one of the rocks that's on there. All right. Practice in the water. <laughs> I don't know if that's going to help. Oh! I touched it. I'm trying to get as far up as I can. Fuck. Maybe in that moment I just need to take the leap and just let it take me. Yes! That's going to save us a lot of time, actually. We can do that consistently. Close! Mouse is the same I'm playing on a controller.
It's probably easier on a fucking mouse keyboard. Maybe I'll try it on a mouse keyboard and see how it is. I just prefer controller. Even if it takes us a few attempts to get up here, I still think it's easier than going all the way around. You just gotta make sure you tear the your rotator cuff in your shoulder. Get your funky ass up there. Oh, dang it. We'll practice at getting this consistently, too. There we go. There we go, baby. Call me a goat because I'm I'm climbing. Get a mountain goat. Dang it! Oh, oh my God! He hit his head on the way down. That was bad. I started turning. Wait, what the fuck is this I see in chat? Your right boob is just as awesome as your left boob. You do not have Poland syndrome. St Wait, what? What the fuck is that? Where did that copy pasta come from? Hey, Seabird, what's up, man? So I heard some of you guys did some uh, co-op with Miss Valentine. Melania do game plus say you guys couldn't beat it, huh? Listen, you guys give you guys give it shit, but that's just fucking when you're in there with a lot of people, that's just tough. Oh we gotta get a good grip on that. It's almost like we have to grab onto that right side, like the other side is a little slippery. Mm, I don't like that positioning. Ah. We've touched it once and we've never reached that same glory again. We've, we touched the peak and yet we may never touch it again.
A little hype for Arch Thrones. Also, we couldn't, uh, but got close a lot of times on Melania. Yeah, I heard. I heard it was fun, though. I'm glad you guys uh, enjoyed your time doing that. I heard fucking uh, Asperich was being a little freaking weasel. I didn't get the exact story. I just heard he was being annoying. Asperger just wanted to touch Melania's feet. Let's be honest. Uh, is that too high? It might be too high. Let's try it from this one. Okay, let's try it from here. This is all we need. Alright. Oh, fuck. Do I play Helldivers? I do play Helldivers. I'm trying to get lost in church to play it again. Church, by the way, being the editor of the Archstones trailer everybody saw. So hopefully everybody gives some props for that one. We're getting a, a slightly bit better with this, at least. We're getting closer and closer. There we go. See, you gotta grab that one specific part right there. Fuck. Have I got any Jar 5 gun from the War Bonds? Very fun gun. No, I haven't. I haven't played enough that I've been able to like grind a lot to get. A bunch of this stuff. I want to. But like playing the game solo is just not as fun as playing co-op. And I got some busy friends, so. Well, I guess we're all busy. If I can get right on the edge, you know? If I get like there. No, why'd he turn like that? Aww. Ah! If it was me in real life, I would have climbed this mountain by with one jump. You know how many cock push-ups I do a day? Fuck. Falling f further down. Huh? Huh? I like the the look of him like trying to reach up. It looks funny. Yeah. 
God, we just gotta get it once, you know? Yeah. We just gotta get it once. It has to be up here, actually. Ah, oh, man. I hate how he turns. Come on, baby. Come on, grab onto that ledge. There you go. Okay, that was a tiny inch closer than last time. It's fine. We fall down so we can get back up. That's what Batman taught me. Remember Alfred telling that to Batman? God damn it. Fuck. There we go. It takes a couple. There's no way we gotta reach that bar. Maybe it's down here. Yeah, okay. Ay, ay, ay. I think I, that one I need more momentum. Am I the real life Bruce Wayne? I don't know, am I? Technically, you don't know what I do in my day to day, so. Well, we made it once, and that's all it takes. I quit. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> I've noticed that I'm really bad at games where I have to climb and if I fall, I lose. The only up mod for Elden Ring, the other Bennett Foddy game. I'm bad at all of them. I feel like that one specific point in the rock is glitched. I don't think it's supposed to be like that. Oh, damn it. 
I'm bad at being precise, kind of, yeah. Maybe it's because of my cleft foot, my cleft hands, my cleft eyes. Maybe that's why I'm bad at being precise. And here you are making fun of it. I wish he'd hit his head on the wheel on the way down and never come back up after the water. We should definitely watch a speed run to this game after though. Kind of reminds me, I need to watch a speedrun to like some of the other games we played. Some of the other souls. I would, I would love to see a Lords of the Fallen speedrun. If they exist. wonder how fast the DLC for Elden Ring will be. What do you mean how fast? Like how long it'll be? I think it'll be a pretty good l length. It costs 40 whole doubloons, so I think it'll be uh, a nice length. They have confirmed it's bigger than Limgrave. And for the most part, Limgrave is like 30 hours. Like, if you really think about your first playthrough of Limgrave, it was about 30 hours. So, I'd imagine it'll probably be pretty, pretty beefy. Yeah. Wait, no. I lost my positioning. Dang it. I don't remember how I even jumped last time. No, that was stupid. And Miyazaki, I mean, Miyazaki said Elden would take 30 hours, which is a wild guest guesstimate, you know, like if he actually said that, that's crazy. Maybe it's like one of those games where it's like, if you want to see everything, it'll take about 100 hours. But if you want to just go for the main bosses and shit, maybe I could see that taking 30 hours for sure. I could probably beat it in way under that if we're just talking about main bosses. But first playthrough, explore everything. That's a 100 hour game for sure. Am I multi-streaming? I am, yeah. Good 
Put your little twinkle toe ass up there. Uh, not a rage, just uh, my my pet name for this guy. I'm a Zen guy, you know. I have I told you one of the little gardens where you have the sand. A little garden, you guys. Does somebody who has a little garden sound like he would get angry at a video game? Fuck. Is this a speed run? Yes. I'm speed running my way to the grave. Refresh, thank you for the 42 months, man. Oops, wrong hand. <laughs> Why did you fucking flip? Is this a game based off a true story? Yeah, mountains exist. But it also depends. Is it based off a true story? I don't know. Why don't you go climb a mountain and find out? You can be you can make it into a true story. Get out there, champ. I think I need more momentum for that one and I didn't use any momentum. Oh. Oh. Okay, for this I've made it. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. I don't like branches. It's the one thing I'm afraid of in life. A branch. There's a little river up here. Let me cook. No. What? Wait, did we maybe reach a new, a new point? Dear God, we're seeing the world. Oh shit, hold on. Oh shit, hold on. Can I, I don't know if I can get up that part. Wait. Where am I going? Is that part of the map? What is that? I think that's in the forefront. Remember my other thing. Oh, he's getting wet.
no, 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 <laughs> I wonder if I can get up down this up this way. I don't think this is a proper checkpoint though. I think this is a mini checkpoint, so if I fall, I can still fall all the way to the bottom. I think there's gonna be a certain point where I cross a threshold where I can still fall all the way to the bottom. It's almost like a resting point. You know what? I'm gonna take this time to use the resting point. <sighs> okay, let's rest our hands. Hey chat, how's it going everybody? How's everybody doing today? Can I get a whoop whoop? See, this is where it would be better if there was a crowd because then everybody would whoop whoop. And then somebody would throw a shoe at me from the crowd. I, I wouldn't get security because I'm like, you know what? I don't need security. But the shoe comes flying through and hits me in the head anyways. And then a bo six bodies rush me and it kidnap me live in front of everybody. What a what a, an adventure that would be, huh? What a live show. Uh, free shoe, true, and it was a, a, some some J's, so. I can probably sell that. What do I think of the live action Fallout? I'll check it out whenever it comes out. Actually, before I started streaming, I was watching a movie. I was watching uh, All Quiet on the Western Front on Netflix. And I only got like halfway through, but it was getting late. So I decided to watch half and then I'm going to watch the rest of it later. I was really into it, but I needed a stream and I didn't want to finish up at like fucking 3 a.m. so if I ever meet you I'm gonna throw a can of beans at you well at least I got a free can of beans did I see what Clark did is this a D's nuts joke Clark D's nuts There's a Fallout LA? What do you mean? Play the clip from Dark Souls 2 SL1 Cat Boss. What clip? Oh, the speedrun. No, I didn't watch it. I didn't want any spoilers. Which sounds stupid, but, you know, it, it like... I wanted to go in blind into the game, so. But I did use somebody's speedrun to help me get up a stupid spot where I didn't know if what I was doing was right. Alright, Nuke, have a good one. When when does the uh, Fallout TV show start? The trailer looked cool. Is this water making anybody else want to pee? April 12th. Oh, it's an Amazon show. Have Amazon had any good shows? I don't know. It's kind of worrying. I actually, thinking about it, I've never watched the full trailer. I watched the teaser that came out. I don't think I watched the trailer. It came out four days ago. Should we watch it? We can watch it. Fuck it. Oh wait, does that it might have copyrighted music? I 
I've asked copyright music, doesn't it? The working man. Sarah, I'm here to show. I bet that's copyrighted. I'll mute it when the music Hello, comes Baron. up. Let's see. I'm here to show you a wonderful place. This guy, I think, plays. He plays a. A veritable Camelot. The nuclear age. I'm surprised they don't play the OG Fallout music, the... Oh wait, oh my god, I'm so stupid. I'm not even showing you guys, this is my bad. You guys are seeing a screen, I'll replay it. I, I, they don't They don't play the original, like... To, to set the world on fire... And it goes into the trailer. I, that would have been great to have for the, for the actual trailer when the teaser came out. I don't know. I, I Maybe I'll give it a shot. I don't know. I have a lot of shit to watch. Anyways. I'd rather watch that one anime that people were recommended to me. That Frey Ren anime. I'll say it looks... Eh. It looks alright. And yeah, the... Uh, the It looks kind of, kind of like plastic, the Brotherhood of Steel armor. Amazon kind of doesn't really have a great reputation when it comes to making shows. Yeah, like maybe Invincible would be like the best thing they've made. Remember that disaster that was the Lord of the Rings. Oh my god. Well, let's just hope it was made with the game in mind. Also, the director, uh, was it Jonathan Nolan? Christopher Nolan's brother? Is, is, he directed the shit out of Westworld season one, like season two were really good. I remember season one was fucking amazing. And then it became garbage. Fuck, it's slippery. Yeah, I've been watching solo leveling. I hate that I had to wait every single week for a new episode. Huh? Oh my god, I cannot grab onto that branch. This game would be really funny in multiplayer, to be honest. If you could climb with a buddy. Alright, here we go. I don't know which way to go though. I'm kind of scared to go right, to be honest, because if I fall down there, I feel like I'm gonna die. Uh, not die, but I'm gonna fall the way to the bottom. Let's go this way. Uh. Oh God, this is really scary. Oh, oh, oh. Don't break. Where am I going? 
This way? Nope. Left. Left where all the rocks are. Wait, did I grab onto that? Uh, it's not a real rock. Let me get a better grip on this. Fuck, am I gonna have to take the leap? Oh, no! Oh my god. Fuck me. Uh, Hamburg use parlay. <laughs> parlay. Thank you so much for becoming a member and joining the Church of Cookie. Enjoy all the emotes. Fuck. Well, at least I didn't fall all the way down. Uh, don't really watch television. I always find myself reading history books and rereading divine comedy books just rather than medium than television. <laughs> fucking nerd! <laughs> I actually wanted to read, uh, because of the movies, I wanted to read the Dune books. I might, I kind of wanted to buy the first one for the, uh, for my long ass plane rides to the UK. I might actually do that. I've heard they're really good. I actually, I actually only read the Bible and encyclopedia letters J through Z. Freaking F is my favorite encyclopedia. Prod audiobook. What do you want me to read? No more Gwendolyn fanfic because I know that's what people are going to request. I'm going to do an audiobook on all of Gwendolyn fan fiction that exists. Wait. I swear. Help! Oh. I am a paralyzed man! What Jedi t fucking training did this- Oh! That was, oh, that was close, dude. Oh, shit, that was scary. He broke his ribs, too. Oh, 
Oh, fuck. I actually wonder if I can grab onto that. I think that might actually be a little too far. Grab with your left hand, you idiot. Um. <laughs> oh my god, that was brutal. I get that he's paralyzed, but he doesn't want to fucking lose his top, the ability to live. He already lost the ability to use his legs. Let's not allow him to use... I don't know what I'm trying to say. His fucking life. <laughs> How did I make it that other time so easily? Is that on there? There we go, baby. That's how you fucking do it. No, Shia LaBeouf! They need to add a feet DLC to this game. What if it's Drury from Street Fighter climbing and they do a Capcom crossover, but she's, she's just climbing with just her feet? Huh? Huh? Mm -mm -mm. Alright, Harukaze, have a good one. I appreciate it as well, thank you. Look at that shit. Just fucking ca call me Alan's Honnold. I have a fun, funny idea, but it might be kind of dumb if it fails and I fall all the way down. Grab onto the fucking piece of wood.
It almost worked. Technically, I think it might work. I just maybe didn't grab it on ex exactly right. Hey, struggling grass soon. What's up, dude? No! How did, out of all the places where I've jumped, that's where I fell? What in the Miyazaki was that bullshit? Fuck. Ah. <laughs> yep. Oh, man. I don't even remember where I am. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Uh. I told you guys it wasn't really a checkpoint. If we fall, we can fall all the way down. In life, there are no checkpoints. You either make it or you don't. No. Oh, man. Well, that was at least as far as we had gotten so far. Sucks we it it felt like it was easy to make it to the next area. I just couldn't get that good that good position on that one rock. The annoying part is I fell on the easy bit of it, you know? Back to this part. Well, I fuck. Oh my god, he's dead. He's dead. Guys, I'm moving the analog sticks and his arms won't work. He's dead. He's just floating in there because of the buoyancy of his dead legs. He's dead. Oh. There we go. He was just knocked out. Thank you, Broderick, for the $2. Back to this jump again, man. Not this one specifically, that other one.
He's drank so much seawater. I wish my shoulder worked this way too. This is the most annoying jump, I think. This is the hardest jump. God damn it. I just can't seem to get that one like consistently. And yeah, I did get past this point. I just fell down again. We go back to talk about Dune instead. <laughs> I think I should go watch it. That shit was fucking great, man. Also, some lady bought me a soda. Oh! I got a free soda out of the adventure. I think it's because they ain't have. So I went to the theater. I wanted some popcorn. They didn't have shit. All they had was soda and every bit of food they had was backed up and they were like, this is going to be like 30 minutes to make anything. So it was worthless there. And then the lady, what different stuff they had. And I think she felt bad that I was, she was taking so long. So when I was like, I'm just going to buy a soda, even though I wanted to ask to see if they had Slurpees, but I could see all the machines were fucking blinking red lights. And uh, I think she felt bad and was like, I'll buy a soda. Free soda. Damn it. Maybe you're not supposed to get that much momentum. Uh, Hillian Centaur, thank you for the 15 long month sub. It's a long time, thank you. Maybe if I try to get closer. Why would if I try to do it from here? Yep, he decided to go that way. Didn't know people actually bought snacks there. Everyone I know just buys their own stuff. Well, I can't exactly buy a, get a Slurpee at home, you know? I was gonna get like a bag of chips. I wanted some popcorn or a Slurpee. I'm not gonna bring a fucking box of popcorn from home. I wanted popcorn or a Slurpee. I should've gone a city walk. It's been so long, but it's. Ugh, I didn't want to take 40 minutes to get to fucking Universal Studios City Walk. But City Walk is a great experience. I love going to City Walk. It was one of my favorite places to go when I was a kid. 
I don't know if they still have it. They used to have a bunch of arcade machines inside of the the movie theater area. We used to play all the arcade games waiting for movies. What's City Walk? City Walk's, uh, it's basically like a, a big thing. They have, like, the movie theater, and then they have a bunch of, mall, like, uh, stores, and then they have a uh, big theme park, Universal Studios. It's essentially outside of Universal Studios. And uh, it's great, but it's also really expensive and, like, 45 minutes away from where I live. But it was a great place to go as a kid. Okay. No. <laughs> Hey, Ramses, what's up? Yeah, it's been a hot minute since I went to City Walk. Last time I went there, I uh, went with a friend. And we bought a bunch of... Uh, I think it was like... Attack on Titan uh, cards. So they have like a little comic book shop. And... Uh, I pulled the rarest card that exists for Attack on Titan collectible cards I still have it in a little sleeve in my drawer at the time it was worth like 200 bucks I actually wonder how much it's worth now that Attack on Titan is finished fuck I hate that jump alright we'll try a little bit more I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it past the point where I did. And then maybe we'll go do some character creating on Dragon's Dogma. But I'll try a couple more times. We'll say four more times. In a jar? I said in a drawer. A drawer. Not where you keep your Ranny doll. Did I get closer to try and get from here? How do I know you keep your Ranny doll there? It's because that's where I keep mine. And since we're, you guys are subscribers of mine, I just assumed we're the same. We like the same things. We laugh at the same things. We keep our Ranny dolls in the same spot. Guys, we're basically the same. I think I realized what I've been doing wrong. I almost want to fall off just to prove my point. I mean, I've already fallen off. But I mean in the video game.
What happened? I blinked. I blinked and I'm down here now. What happened? What happened? I blinked. <laughs> now I get to prove the, my point. Hey, Phoenix. What is this game? It's a difficult game about climbing. Get your twinkle toe ass up there. This guy actually, he covers his ass because he has no crack. And he doesn't like that. He's ashamed of it. Watch, ready? I'm going to get up there right now first try. I got close. I touched it. So I was right in knowing that I, f I did something wrong. I think for my next stream, I'm going to cosplay this guy. Shave my head bald and wear a little thing. Oh, fuck. To the left, to the right, and then go wild. I don't even know what part of the rock he just grabbed there. <laughs> Fuck! Why am I fucking up so much now? I feel like I got that last time. Why won't he use his legs? Guys, he's paralyzed. We've taken about one Dark Souls 3 playthroughs worth of time. And we haven't even gotten past the second half of the game.
I should just go for it. Dang it. Sometimes when you throw yourself, he will aim right and go right with both his hands, and sometimes he'll start flipping left. God damn it. Not rage, just voicing my frustrations in a violent way. Of a bitch. <sighs> okay. Yo, I bet he's getting so much moss on his fingers. Have I read yet? No, I would never. Does it count as raging if I press the rage quit button? There's a rage quit button? Yeah, instead of exit, it, the button's called rage quit. You see down in the bottom right? It's just called rage quit. God damn it. Gosh dang it. Petunias. He falls well or jumps well. All right. 
Hey, Drop Rain, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. I appreciate that very, very much. Thank you, man. Enjoy them all, everybody. Make sure you guys give a nice, a nice big thank you if you got gifted a sub. I appreciate it very much. Oh. Enjoy all the emotes, the ad free viewing, all that good stuff. For one whole month. That momentum, there you go. Huh. Oh. And drop ring with another gifted sub. I appreciate that very much. Alright. I think what we're going to do is stop with this game for now. I don't think I'm going to make it back there. I don't. But I think what would be fun is if we watch the speed run. But you know what? Actually, let me try once real quick with mouse and keyboard. Let me try with mouse and keyboard, actually. I haven't done the with mouse and keyboard. Okay, this seems really hard with mouse and keyboard. But I also suck with mouse and keyboard, so... I'm trying it with mouse and keyboard now. It feels so awkward, mouse keyboard. Dude, it feels awkward. Maybe it's just because I suck with mouse keyboard, though. I can at least, I think, make this with mouse keyboard. Maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe I won't even make this. Nah, we got this shit. He's gotta, he just gotta get his diaper up there. Is it just left click and right click? You could also do mouse movement or you could press W to go up. to at least see how it is. Alright. All F4. So I ain't rage quit. What rage quit? No rage. I want to watch the speed run. Okay. A difficult game about climbing speed run. So I guess what would be... Is it 755 I'd imagine is... 755, I think, is the current world record. You get a top hat? Oh. Maybe I should beat this game. All right. Let's go ahead and watch the speed run. Let's do it like that. There you go. Let's see. 
So he is using uh mouse keyboard. Holy shit, he's a speed demon. Waterbeard, thank you for the 49 months, man. Dude, he did that so... Oh, isn't about to piss me off how he does this. So easy. Oh, my lord. I hate myself and him. So smooth. What? I didn't even know that you could do that. This is where I didn't. I didn't. I fell there. Oh, it's so easy. I don't even know why I fell, dude. Oh. A little branch? Oh no. Oh shit. What? It gets wild up here. Oh hell no. Hey, Pim Jack, thank you for the raid. Welcome in, everybody. Hey, hopefully your stream went well. I'm watching a speedrun of this freaking game. This is crazy. Holy shit. Oh no. Oh wow, that was fucking clutch. Oh, you could also fall to your death there. Oh. <laughs> I I would I, I I wouldn't be able to do this. Like just straight up, I I, I feel like I, you gave me fifty hours. I just I don't think I'd be able to do this. It's kind of like platformers where I just I am awful at these type of video games. They got the J's up there. Oh my god, who threw those J's up there? What the fuck? Oh, I see. Wow. This just has me like speechless. It's it's crazy. No, I would not be able to do this. Dr. Phil J, thank you for the 29 months, man. Thank you. Just completed my first poorly translated run of DS2, and now my brain has <laughs> PLS help with my Nicholas freak out. 
Hey, hopefully you enjoyed it, Drop Rain. Thank you for the thousand bits as well, man. I appreciate it very, very much. Poorly translated will change you. It'll turn you into a different man. The words in your vocabulary afterwards will would shock anybody. This is crazy. Turning my PlayStation on. Oh, let me pause this. Get a new tab on this side. I will say this game's like the controls are better in my opinion than uh that Bennett fought a game we played. thumbnail for Dragon's Dama character creator, but on YouTube we'll leave it as that, but I did change the title. Am I gonna bring out New Game Plus 7 character for Shadow of the Earth Tree? Probably not. I don't have one. Valentine has one, but if I ever want to play it, I guess I'll use hers. So that's the one? That's the end here? Oh no, it keeps going? You can go to clouds? By the way, do you think, right, do you think that the creator of the game finished it? Because my guess would be no. Like, do you think he did it from start to finish? I would say no way. Oh, look at that. It has a special thanks to Bennett Foddy. That's cute. To live is to suffer. To survive is to find some meaning in the suffering. That's a cute message at the end. And then you start at the beginning. Dear God, it's a loop. He's stuck in an endless loop. That's a cute message. I will say, though, that is, uh, it's, a game like this is, like, the reason a lot of people love the Souls games, you know? Like, people love that struggle. I personally love that struggle when it's a game that I have, like, better control of. I, like, just suck at these type of fucking games, but there's people who are good at them. I am not one of them. But that is a big reason why I love the Souls games, you know, that struggle against a boss that takes forever and finally overcoming that struggle is, I think, one of the most unique things for uh, for video games that you don't see a lot. All right. So now we're going to fuck around to make a character in Dragon's Dogma 2. I've heard this character creator is absolutely wild and I've been wanting to test it out. We'll see how it is. People are sending me their monsters in this thing, and they, it, it looks incredible. The monsters people have been able to make in this are insane. I will do... Adjust until the pattern... Wait, what are we doing? What is this? Barely visible.
This game is also dark as shit. I also, uh, I played, when I played this, when I went to play Dragon's Dogma 2, I had a really hard time seeing it because it is very dark. A lot of people are also giving me shit about the whole FPS thing. People gotta realize, I played this thing in an office where the light was shining on the goddamn TV and I could barely see half the goddamn screen most of the time. Whenever it was nighttime. Right, that's good. Alright, Gerard. Have a good one. Dragon's Dogma 2. Character creator and storage. So yeah, this will carry over to uh, the full game. Let's see what options we got. Except that, just that. Carry it over to the full game. Edits to the finalized character. You know what's supposed to also have a, a great character? Creator? Uh, uh, Team Ninja's new game. Oh, I'm just going to tweet out that we're uh, on this now. Drop something on my phone. What is that? It feels sticky. I think I dropped some of my coffee on it. I just saw my own fingerprint. Alright. First, let's make our Arisen. Us. Main character. We got five slots. So the first character I want to try to make is Connie. I want to see if we can make, or not Connie, Bonnie, I think I called her. So we want to be a, a female. Let's do female. So this is the base. The tiniest character. Adjust a face to see your liking. Making the selection over three stages, you will be able to see them. Use a head to have chosen base for the customization. Okay, so this is just the face. I tell you, this game is freaking beautiful, man. The character, the characters look so good. The character customization as well. Okay, so modern. Let me let me bring up a picture of how. She looked. Hold up. Oh, stupid ass fucking. Give me a sec. <laughs> I only have a thumbnail, but you'll be able to see how she looks. There you go. So that's, that there is I Bonnie, beefy Bonnie we called her. She was a tiny character, but she was fucking ripped. So that's what we're aiming for. 
Uh, I just wanted to have her on the side just so I can kind of get a, a look at her. And Guts was our main pawn in Dragon's Dogma 1 as well. All right, Lord Zonaz, have a good one. All right, she had a pretty cute face. She had long hair that went down to like her shoulder. Ah, there she is. Oh my God, dude, this is scary. All right, I'm gonna pick that face, but a different hairstyle. Okay, this is hair. Okay. Kind of looks like a Valentine, actually. Uh, I swear this hair looks like it'd be in Baldur Skate. I want to play Baldur Skate. So she had kind of this hair, but kind of the opposite side. What is this? Her head? Her head shape? Selected a base head. Would you like to customize it further? Yes. Okay. Yo, she took AF though. We can use her chest size? Hey, yo! This character creator is the. Oh my god, this is the GOAT! Dude! This is the fucking go. Alright. Body. Height. Oh, that's the smallest we can make them. Adventures of Guts and Bonnie Part Tool. Hot Poggers, how much protein do you think is going to be in this game? <laughs> She's going to be able to take all the protein. We'll see. Muscle style. Alright, how muscular can she be? Okay, so she's kind of cut there. Torso length is weird. I don't know where to put it. Muscle strength. Okay, maxed out muscle strength. Trap size. So we can actually edit each individual muscle. What the fuck is that? I think 33? One of the early ones was the best one, I think. That is not... What is that? That's like an old person. I think this is the strongest she can be. Muscle mass? Oh. So her weight does actually increase. Lower body muscle mass. So that was the thing too. She had skinny ass legs, but they were cut. Okay. <laughs> okay that's good unfortunately we can't make her any stronger than that am i doing a one-to-one -one recreation from the looks of it already it's impossible like that's as strong as we can make her muscles maybe there'll be more after but from the looks of it that's as as strong as as ripped as we can make her She's kind of ripped, but not like Bonnie. I will right, we'll make her thick. Okay, head. Head's, Connie had a massive head. <laughs> okay. Head length. Oh my god, we could squish her goddamn head down. 
Okay, we'll leave it at what it was. Head width. I love, by the way, when you do that, her her she gets a little bit heavier. Head depth. Okay, I see. Face height. Okay, it looks the best where it was. I'm just kind of testing stuff out and see where stuff end up. Neck height. Yeah, a little bit. She has a giant head, so. Neck thickness. Connie had a thick ass neck for sure. Can I zoom in? Yeah, there we go. Yeah, there we go. That's good. Oh my god. It looks like she swallowed a frog. Shoulder width. Can I move her more to the side or is that... Okay, I just gotta zoom out a little bit. She looks a little more cut now. By the way, the details and stuff are fucking good in this game. The graphics are insane. Not even focusing just on that part. She's a little bit yoked, yeah, sort of. Whoa, okay, we got her arms fucking massive. Connie got some wide ass shoulders. <laughs> okay, maybe not that far out. Look at her back, she's built like a tank from the back. Chest thickness. There you go. How much weight does she gain because of her chest thickness? She puts on a couple pounds. Definitely biggest chest size. Chest shape. More together. Yeah, okay. That's good. Does that look weird? Chest height. Okay, that's that's all right. Torso width. I wish you, she had a better six pack. Cause Connie, I mean, if I show you Connie's six pack, you'd start crying. Torso depth. What does that mean? Oh, like a stomach. Sorry, I meant to say Bonnie, not Connie. Virtual Sword, thank you for the 23 long month sub. I think she had a little too wide from there. Same goes for the, I guess if we can't get all of her, might as well make her a little bit. Not so cartoonish. Arm size. Fuck yeah, dude. She fucking boot. Upper arm thickness is already maxed. Oh my God. Well, she's gotta be able to carry guts. Is the thing, right? Forearm thickness. Oh, the forearms. Okay, there we go. Waist. Dude, she gotta be thick AF. She gonna be built like a chicken crossing the road. Wait, that didn't move. Is it this way? Oh, yeah, I see. Okay. Rear size. You can do the size of her ass? Oh, my God. This game. This is the greatest video game ever. I'm also making the weirdest character. Okay. 
overall leg size. Bigger, thicker legs. There we go. Thigh size. Max that shit out. Calf size. What if we do the smallest thing? <laughs> oh, she looks so weird. It, it, it looks so out of proportion if I don't do max size on the calves. Dude, she looks so odd already. Oh my god. That's Bonnie. Okay, that's good. Posture. Movement style. What does that mean? When she walks? I could specifically change the angle of her knees. I wanted her to walk more ladylike. At the end of the day, Bonnie was very feminine. Is this out or in? I honestly... Okay, so this is in. Well, she's got to walk slow or else the cheeks clap too much and then she gets too much attention to herself. Every time she walks, it's like... And that's a regular ass stroll, you know? Like... Posture? <laughs> She looks like a fucking troll. Oh my god. She could walk with uh, the greatest posture in the world. Almost looking to the her back. Def that's almost bad for you at that point, right? Should we give her a little bit of a gamer back? There we go. That's good. That's crazy, by the way. What a character. Cre I've never seen that. I've never seen a character creator where they let you change the posture of your fucking elbows and your knees when you walk. That's wild. Dragon's Dong was two's out? No, just a character creator. Alright, cool. Uh, honestly, her skin color looks pretty spot on to Connie's, or Bonnie's skin color. It looks pretty spot on, so I might just leave it. Like, exactly as is. Wrinkles? What about- how, how does Max wrinkles look? Wait, where is she getting these wrinkles? On her face? Am I crazy? Because I don't see them. Oh, it's like her mouth? I don't see him. Skin sheen? Ugh, she's got the oiliest of skins. Oh, well, she's working out all the time. It's all those steroids. Give her all that oily skin. We gotta give her a little bit of a shine just enough so that people think, you know, like, you know when they say you, you're glowing? That's good. Her brow? Honestly, her eyebrow game's on, on point. Them bitches look good as fuck. I don't even know if I want to mess with them. Maybe actually the only thing is make them a little higher. There we go. I actually really like that. Eye height. Eyes are good too. So this is our normal character, by the way. I'm still, we're still gonna make a monster. So that's, I'm not going too crazy. We're gonna make a monster still. Her eyes size, bigger eyes, like anime character. Okay. I can make her left eye squint. So she has almost a lazy eye. What do you guys think? Give her a <laughs> She's got that crazy eye. Those them steroids are not doing great for her. I could make just her Oh dude, we could be able to make fucking guts with his eye closed. I kinda wanna give her a lazy eye, that makes me laugh. 
Should we give her a lazy eye? Unite the brow? Give her a uni brow? No. She's got to be cute, you guys. Close both eyes so she walks around. <laughs> so she's walking around with both eyes closed. Oh, man. Bonnie's always asleep. Okay. Nose. Uh, I have Connie's or Bonnie's. I keep saying Connie. She's got a wide, yeah, that nostril size. A little bit bigger. A little bit bigger than average. There we go. Nostril height. <laughs> <laughs> she's like a snake. Alright, I actually liked the, what they had default. I'm trying to do Bonnie, but more in the style of 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 now. So, we, since we can't make her as ripped as she usually is, unfortunately, we kind of just gotta, we gotta do what we can. Tip sharpness? The sharpest tip? She's got a very sharp tip. Yeah, actually, you know what? We'll give her a sharp nose tip. Why not? Years. We ain't even going to be seeing them bitches. Can we make them so big that they pop out? Toggle equipment. Oh, I could put armor on her. So this is how she's going to look with armor. I can also change the lighting, apparently. So these are the different... Uh, wow, this character creator is crazy. Oh, we can change the location of where we put her. I kind of like that. Let's see it in this in this scenario. What are we doing now? The size of her ears. They're they're actually almost so big that you can see them clip. I want to make them so big that if we somehow get a get a chance to see them, they're going to be laughably huge. Oh my god, you can actually see the right one popping out. Dude, her right ear is popping out of her fucking head, out of her hair. She's got rat ears. Oh my god. Oh, we could turn her into like an elf, actually. No, I want her to be a human. I would just want her to have big ass ears. Okay, there we go. Maybe at some point we'll forget that we did this with the ears, and then when we have a situation where we change her hair, we can. Oh, we could actually. I guess we could change her hair. Hairstyle three. <laughs> she looks like a mouse. Holy crap. Look at that ear! Like, she can put all of her entire hair behind that ear. You ain't missing out anything there. If we had this hairstyle, but her hair was longer... That'd be, like, exactly Connie's hair. Fuck! Bonnie's hair from my first Dragon's Dogma playthrough. Should we give her this hairstyle? <laughs> she looks like a landlord who does not get paid rent on time. That's... Wait, that's the hairstyle of the dude from, uh... Fucking... Yakuza. That's kind of cute. I kind of like that hairstyle. 
Should we maybe have this be her new hairstyle? Her ears are massive, though. Oh my god. From the back, they look like they both got stung by bees. Okay, I'd like 56 as maybe a new hairstyle. Ooh, that looks nice, too. She's very radish. That's pretty cute. I like that. Should we give her an? I, we could give her uh, an afro. Double ponytails, so you got something to grip onto. We could give her the. <laughs> oh my god. I would never do that one. She hundred. She looks like an actual rat. No, she's a rat, dude. That's a fucking. That's a rat. Hmm. Leon. I. They hundred percent added this hair because of Leon, right? We could give her short hair. No, I like the long hair on her. I kind of like this. Let's go with that. We can make her. Uh, what was Bonnie? Let me hold on. Let me click on the video. I got an ad. I just want to see what Bonnie's hair color was. Yeah, dude, Dragon's Dogma's character creator, the first one, is crazy. Let me let me show you guys. They literally had characters that look like children. You see that shit? That's a goddamn child. Dragon's Dogma one was different. That's how I was able to make Bonnie so little, because the character that you have is basically a fucking child. She's child-sized. Okay, so this is... Ah, uh, they kind of look similar. Kind of. A little bit. Let me show you. Okay, so keep her face in your memory, right? Keep it in your memory. No, they don't really look too similar. This could be a, just a, you know, this is the modern day version of her. Face in your memory. And then. Eh, ah, kind of. We need to make her hair black, though. That was the other character here. Where's the other one? There we go. That was good. We can do that one. <laughs> so yeah, look how fucking jacked you can make her in, in Dragon's Dogma 1. Smaller eyes, you think so? We're making a different version. We're making a bigger eared one. Big eared Bonnie. Yeah, we can't we can't really recreate that, unfortunately. She's so jacked. Look at her tits. They're clipping through the through the thing. It's, it's kind of hard to remake that with this one's character creator. It doesn't go to the, that extremity. But I'm going to keep that page up because I, I want to get her hair color at least. Not enough chromosome. What? Wait, you think... Wait, which body is missing chromosomes? This one or the old one? You think she's missing a couple here? What? What? Because of the ears? You guys are ear cysts. She's actually... Oh, okay, so this is going to be a big tell, right? This is 100%. You can see it's a different version of her. Because keep, keep in mind how thick her bottom is here. And then we have this. You see how thin her legs are. So this Bonnie, 
thick body. She's she's got she got that BB BBL. And here she's got she got them steroids going. It's a different we're going a different direction here. One's got steroids, one's got that BBL. Unhinged Mikola with the seven month sub. Alright, so she had kind of like dark brown hair. I can't believe you guys think that this one's missing more chromosomes than the fucking first one. Okay, that's actually kind of exactly the color she has. The color of her tip? What? Oh, the tip of her hair. I actually kind of dig that. What about we make her the color of her hair tip like a lighter brown? Oh, it turns the ponytail like that color. Actually looks kind of nice. Do that. The sheen on her hair. Make her hair shinier. She's, I would say this, uh, this bonnie is a lot more rat like. So you did maybe smaller eyes? The smallest of eyes? That just makes her more, look more like a rat. No, actually the bigger eyes kind of make her look more like a rat, huh? <laughs> her fucking ears. I'm keeping the ears because they make me laugh. Fine, we'll do little eyes. Little eyes, big, big rat ears. Nose, cheeks. Wait, I didn't even edit her cheeks. Cheek thickness. What's that surgery where people, the fucking, they get that fat removed from their, the side of their cheeks? <laughs> Give her big old chubby cheeks. Cheek bulge. She's got a big ass cheek bulge. Oh my god. <laughs> Facelift, liposuction, Botox? No, it's um... It's from that, it's this one part in their goddamn like cheekbone. I can't remember what it's called. It's like the new big thing in Hollywood and everybody looks awful when they get it done. Cheek width. Mm -mm. Okay, we'll keep that. Her mouth. Connie? Oh, yeah, that buccal fat removal shit. There you go. That thing looks awful. Lip thickness. Connie has some... Bonnie has some thick lips. She had the DSLs. Mouth corners. Marika's tits. Uh, her lips might be a little too thick. It almost looks like she got stung by a bee a little bit. Which is a good look. That'll get you far in Hollywood. Evil one! Thank you so much for the gifted sub. I appreciate that very much, man. Thank you. All right, that's good. Jaw. We got to get our more jaw definition. There we go. Jaw width. 
Oh my god. Alright. Chin height. <laughs> She's a Giga Chad. Okay, make it a little lower. All right, that's good. Hairstyle, we pick the hairstyle. Or should we do, maybe we should do something that covers the ears. The ears are kind of distracting. I want maybe something that like they pop out from the side occasionally. Like our first hairstyle. Man, they pop out completely there. Like, no, honey, no matter how much you try to hide it, you ain't hiding them bitches. Sorry. Ah! Uh, maybe? That's a kid snatcher haircut, right? And a monk haircut? This was the first haircut that we did get a look at. Only one kind of pops out. We'll do that one. Eyebrows look good. Eyes. What is this? Edit each eye separately. Eye style. Oh, I see the pupils. Her eye color. Bonnie had brown eyes. But if we're doing a different style of Bonnie, we can give her a different color. Ooh, I kind of like those. Those are kind of cool. Like green. I kind of want to give her two different color eyes. What eye is this, left or right? Okay, this one. If we give her a, a blue eye, Oh my lord. With one with an iris that has taken over almost the, the whole eye. I want the iris to take over the whole eye, but a tiny pupil. And then her right eye could be like uh, whatever that color is. I'm pretty sure she's dying. She's almost certainly dying. All right, we'll keep it normal. I want to make her eyes so big that it changes the her total weight. All right, that left eyes. I'm going to keep it all fucked up like that. Eyelashes. All right, what type of eyelashes should we get her? Thick eyelashes, there you go. We keep it black. Long eyelashes, girls like that. So I'd imagine she would too. The How thick you want them. Thick, long eyelashes. Eyeshadow. You have all types of eyeshadow. No eyeshadow. It gets in the way of her working out on her protein eating. Eyeliner. Oh, Valentine's gonna love this game's character creator. It's pretty good so far, man. It's very extensive. No eyeliner. Freckles. Have you guys seen that neat trend? Oh, maybe not this far, but that neat trend where Girls will like put fake freckles on themselves. That happens quite often. I've seen that on TikTok. Hi, right, Botan. Have a good one. 
Mild brain damage? Yeah, well, she had a weight fall on her head. Alright, we won't give her any freckles. Cheek style? What the hell does that mean? Oh, her cheek. Give her blush? What is that? It's like dirt. Okay. Uh, I prefer without. It looks better without. That one, it almost looks like she accidentally bit her lip. This one looks like it's it, she's got frostbite on her lips. If we give her a red kind of hue. Uh, she, her her lips look swollen. What do we have before one? Yeah, okay. I'm just gonna leave it at that. Teeth. What the fuck? Upper teeth. Wait, what? We can do that? What the fuck? She's missing all her teeth? Ew, that's so... Oh, that looks so gross, dude. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? You can see like the the where the teeth like were in there. You can see the socket. Oh my lord. What if we give her just her fangs? There we go, just that. So if she ever bites you, it's she's like a monster. Yeah, we're going to keep all our teeth. You know what? Crazy, I know, but we're keeping all our teeth. I right, can make her teeth not exactly white. Completely pitch. She was eating some squid ink pasta. There we go. That looks fine. I, like, straight up cannot believe you can make, like, get rid of one as a treat. What? Which one? Just one in the middle? One of the big front ones? <laughs> what do you think? That one? No, dude, it ruins her smile. She's not gonna be fucking smiling. She eats. You think she ate a big piece of protein and it was too much? She bit into a, an extra tough piece of steak. She definitely has a lisp. Yeah. She's going to be talking like this. We'll give her one missing tooth. That'll be a secret just between us. Tattoos. Oh, let's see what presets they got. They got a they got a couple tattoos. Oh my gosh, it looks like she was in prison. Oh, that's like the rocks tattoo. Mixed with Mike Tyson. That looks kinda cool. What if it's that but white? Her ass looks gross in the light. What the fuck? What is that? That's a tattoo? Oh, well, that... She looks like Fia after a, a long night. We gotta have a tattoo? That's kind of cool, I guess.
edit body tattoo. I wanted to change the color. Oh, it doesn't look that good when it's white. Would that ruin her gains though? You know, would she get a tattoo? I don't think she would actually. Maybe she'd get something small. Probably on her one of her big ass fucking thighs. Body scar. Like a cut? That's a big ass scar. You cut her half her tit off. I guess we already have the one scar. Uh, let me see. Right leg tattoo? Oh. He's on the actual leg part. How about <laughs> on the side of her leg? Should we put throw some dirt in her eye? Wait, where does she have dirt? On her face? I don't see the dirt. Do you guys see dirt? Oh, dirt coverage. Oh my god, she's a racist. That's super dirty. She's just a fucking pig at that point. Just wash yourself, woman. Somebody needs to hose her ass down. No dirt. You know what? I'm not gonna put dirt on her. That was pretty good. I kind of like this is Bonnie. Can I give her body hair? No, I cannot give her body hair. Maverick, thank you for the 23 long month sub. I thought you loved dirty feet. Excuse me? You're thinking of Hidetaka Miyazaki, the creator of Demon Souls. Um. I kind of want to make her, her, her legs thinner. I think her legs look a little too, a little too thick. Body, head, lower body, waist, legs, overall size. Her ass, I think, is the thing that looks so fake. How about we just give her just some ass? Maybe we make her way smaller. Her ass stays. She looks like a she. This has been built like an ant. I think that looks better, at least. 
If you toggle the equipment, you'll see the problem. Hey, yo. I see no problem at all. No problem. In fact, it looks better with armor. Yo, what problem? I'd make it bigger if I could. All right. I kind of like this as our first character. How she look when she walks? Pretty good. All right, how do we save her finalize? Feminine human. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Yes, feminine, feminine human is good. Detail customization. Okay, we did that already. Oh, the vocation. So I guess this is where we decide what do we want. I kind of want a mage. How does she look as a mage? Should we make her, maybe we could make her a thief? Stabs and cast a variety of spells. Their command of enchantments and curative magics make them a helpful additional to any party. Addition to any party. It can be changed later anyways. I want to see how her ass looks in all the armors. Fighter is the best looking one. Flash of daggers on the battlefield too quick for the eye. Their speed and agility allow them to break through the enemy's guard with ease. This is what we were in the first game. She had the double, double swords, double daggers. Does she clap when she's running... At, to, if you take off the armor, yeah. Oh, she walks. She th that and them cheeks be clapping. That's why she tends to not walk a lot of places. I think for now, I I kind of want to try it out as mage, and I want to see how the mage is. Her voice. Wait, I wanted to listen to them. We need female voices. Yeah, there you go. She, is that how she's gonna sound? Where are the female voices? Oh, so it's the same voice, just pitched higher, I see. All right, let's do Valiant Hero. All right, mage, feminine human, ripped AF, BBL. She got that BBL action. This is Bonnie. Bonnie V2. There we go. We got... Bonnie I want to see do do we give her a last name <laughs> No 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 Bonnie I like Bonnie let's just go with Bonnie Her moniker Wait what what is this? Yes, yeah, people her people call her Barack. 
What is this? Is this like what people call her? Choose a name and moniker. Like her nickname? Sugar tits. Just like Miyazaki's moniker, Rudy. Oh, I see. Okay. Camel toe, maybe? Chun Li, what? Corn. <laughs> yeah, people call her. <laughs> Yeah, that's it. Her moniker is corn. <laughs> well, there you go. It's corn. Bonnie and her moniker is goddamn corn. Holy shit. Hey, Venus, thank you for the 46 month. Hope we see a lot of feet in this game. We've been we haven't been able to edit the feet, unfortunately. I can't edit how big her ankle bones are. Dude, corn is good. I kind of want to see what other monikers they have, though. We'll keep corn in mind. In in mind. Yeah, people will call her Derek. Dog. Hey, what up, dog? Her name is Bonnie, but people call her Donna. Doctor Willy. Why? You think they'll have pizza? Peter, Peter Griffin. Pickle. Dude, Priscilla? I'm doing Priscilla. Bonnie, but her moniker is Priscilla. I kind of like corn, but Priscilla, we gotta do Priscilla. Maybe we should try to make Priscilla. And see how that comes out. If we make a fluffy waifu. Nick, thank you for the eight months, man. I appreciate that very, very much. Thank you. And Maverick, thank you as well for almost two years, dude. Neurons with the 15 months. Thank you all. All right. Finalized character creation. That is her. She got that BBL. Dude, I think we're good. Yes. Alright, we got Bonnie. Have you told me you can do Lois Griffin's voice too? I think you did show me, yeah. Peter. When you create a character in Dragon's Dogma 2, you'll be given the option to use existing data, allowing you to import appearances. Purchase the full release. We will. What should we do? Should we make a, an, a pawn? Or should we make another main character? They said we had, what, a couple slots, right? We could try to make a pawn. We got a bunch of empty pawn slots. Should we make a, a cat? A cat waifu? Rani and Lois fighting your head all this. That's a hell of a fucking battle. We can make a, a big cat waifu. Oh, she, that's, she, dude, she actually looks really cute. Like, I, not like cute, cute, like in a furry way. I mean, like, I want to pet her because she looks fluffy. Dude, the fur physics are fucking amazing. What the hell? Holy shit. Meow. I'm, hey, I'm about to give this one a bowl of milk to mop up. Let's give her a bowl of milk. You want a you want a bowl of milk, honey? <laughs> this has spots. That's pretty good. Okay, what is this one? Different head size. What if? What if our character is just one of the bald cats? You see those weird ass bald cats? 
Alright. That's good. We'll make a bit uh fur color. So we have a bunch of different types of fur. Look how good the fur physics look. That's like the best cat like character I've ever seen in a video game. That's crazy. Different patterns, different fur types. We can give her thick fur or, or sort of a thinner type of fur. Th I'll do thicker fur. Different patterns. She's got spots like a cheetah. Sort of stripes. Should we also give the cat a giant ass? Definitely no Valentine doesn't like you for your pillow talk. What do you mean? She loves when I ask if she wants a bowl of milk. Uh, let's do... Kind of like the one that had the white fur. That's kind of interesting too. Full on just black fur like a panther. I kind of like white with the black spots. Color intensity. What does that mean? Oh, like super fucking white. I like the idea of the spots being super dark. By the way, you see how she keeps doing that with her mouth? Like the... She's like, like her actual cat. Yeah, I don't even... I, how do people want to fuck these? There's no way, dude. This is just like an actual cat. And I'm talking about cat women, by the way. This is just like a straight up, like a kitty cat. This is too far into the cat realm. If you're attracted to this, I, I, I got some delectable words for you. Some interesting words. Holy shit, we can make her even bigger. Torso length. She's got to have a long torso like a real cat. She's fucking huge. She's got claws on her feet. Look at him. She needs to trim her. She needs to trim her nails. But you got to be careful. You're gonna hit the wick. Muscle strength. A very muscular cat. Cat. Upper body size. <laughs> we give her a big belly. do that we're still gonna get i mean you know don't get me wrong we're still gonna give her a giant milkers obviously chest thickness we're still gonna give her some milkers you know shoulder size i think that's a good shoulder size I want to make a fucking monster after this, too, so we'll try to go quickly with the cat. I want to see if we can get ourselves a good a good monster. We got to give her a BBL as well. No, we'll make hers smaller. Leg size. She can really sprint after you. Like a cheetah, you know? Your cat responded to the pss, 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 pss. <laughs> That's a good cat. I want her to walk <laughs> like movement style. Max speed. Worst posture. <laughs> That's pretty good. I don't know why. I kind of like that on her. The angle of her knees. I 
Look how she's walking. She, she's walking like, you know that picture of uh, John Lennon when he's walking with his knees out? But I guess she would have to have a back, her back straight for that. Oh my gosh, she's walking like that fucking John Lennon picture. You would date this cat girl? She's too fu What? Everything's furry, by the way. I like her posture. I like that. All right, her head. Oh, I kind of like that one. It's kind of like a smaller cat face. Her brows. Does she even have eyebrows? Every everything is a fucking eyebrow. I guess this is just like her eye, her actual brow itself. There's people that are gonna say, by the way, that Khajiits look better that in, in Skyrim than this. They're out of their minds. This looks unbelievable. Her eyes, eye height, okay, eye size already like max. We can give her really little eyes. What if she has her right eye closed? She got <laughs> both eyes closed. <laughs> I kind of like the idea of her having both her eyes closed. Should we have her both her eyes closed? All right, both her eyes are gonna be closed. She's napping. Oh, shh, guys, she, she's she's sleepy. Shh. Don't wait the don't wait the kitty cat. Shh. Nose. Big kitten nose. Ears? Do cats even have big ears? That's a pretty big ear. That's a big cat ear. I kind of like the idea for some reason of making this one just hurry as sharp. Oh, you can't really see anyways too much. Ear twist. What? Cheeks? Big fat cheeks. <laughs> she, that just kind of made her look like she has a swollen face. Like a bee. She swallowed a bee. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Mouth. We got to give her them, them DSLs. I mean, how about a, a nice... Uh, a nice height mouth. Lower though. She kind of looks like a, a kitten. Whisker position. I never thought I'd say that. Where should we position our whiskers? It literally looks like... A kitten face. That's f so funny. What is this furry bullshit? We're making a. She's a little kitten. Okay, I like that. Her hairstyle. What hairstyle should we give the kitten? <laughs> Bald? What about half bald? The balding kitten. No, <laughs> oh, I kind of like that. It's so stupid. The balding cat? Or the afro cat? Oh my god. The half balding cat.
Okay, I'll give her proper hair. Fine. Give her the pigtail so you got some good grip on there. Uh, oh, it kind of looks like a lion. I feel like that would look better on a male cat, though. Well, you guys like the bald? But she's a girl. <laughs> oh, frickin' uh, a mohawk. It bothers you that I'm saying kitten? But it is! Look at the face! What about we do that? What color can we do? Like a gold? Like a mane? A lion's mane? Uh, I don't like that too much. I don't like once you put color on it. like that let's do that white hair lots of sheen because she licks herself whoa what the fuck that's kind of cool. Huh? Mm, let's play around with this. Let's see. Two different types of white. Can we see how pretty her eyes are? But she's see she's sleepy. I'll open her eyes for a moment. I'm gonna keep her eyes closed though. There you go. We could see what type of eyes we got. Let's see. So we got a couple different styles. We could make her a blind cat. Oh, they actually have like the pupils of a cat. Cat pupils and then human pupils. The eyes look okay. She's sleepy though. Eyelashes? Bitch, her whole face is an eyelash. What do you mean, eyelashes? Teeth! Oh no, can we remove teeth on this too? No, we can't! Oh. <laughs> oh god! We can remove the teeth! Ugh! No, I'm keeping all her teeth. I'm keeping all her goddamn teeth. But her teeth will be a, lo a little yellow. There you go. Claw color? I could choose the color of her claws? Look at her paws! Yo, show me your goddamn feet! There we go. Wait, what other color would they be other than black? Wait, they mean claws on her, like her hands? Wait, does she have, uh... 
Does she have the little cat beans? What are they, what are they called? It almost looks like she did. I'll just keep it as default. Toe beans, that's what it is, yeah. Wait, we can give her tattoos. Oh shit! They painted her titties. Why does cat got her titties painted? Oh, she she got the Brock Lesnar. You think just under that brawl she has all the six nipples? Oh, that's kind of cool. It's on her fur. What if it's, it's just a fur pattern? It's not even a tattoo. Ah! There we go. I actually kind of dig that. That looks kind of sick. Alright. I kind of like that. Should we make her a dirty cat? That was a weird thing to say. Look how f this is all dirt, by the way. She's filthy. She got inside of a of a fucking in a car. She got in a damn car. The cat. All right, no. Keep it. We'll keep her sheen. I like that. Finalize that. We're done there. Vocation. She's agile. We'll make her a thief because she's an agile cat. Her inclination. Hmm. We'll make her calm. Calm, white. Wait, these are her voices. The people here are evacuated and safe for the moment. The people here are evacuated. The people here are evacuated. The people here are evacuated and safe for the moment. The people here are evacuated and safe. The people here are evacuated. The people here are evacuated. <laughs> oh my safe. god. The people here are evacuated. There are more who can yet. There are more who can yet be saved. So there's one female voice. There are more who can yet be saved. Okay, we'll do that. That's good. Uh <laughs> We'll dedicate this one to Valentine. This is Kato. There we go. Even though it looks nothing like Kato, if I wanted to make another cat that looked like Kato, it would be better. And her nickname will be Corn. <laughs> Chad. <laughs> That's kind of funny. So if you call her, if you call the main name Giga, and then the second one Chad. Oh, her nickname is gonna be Claw. There we go. Yes! Nice. Alright, now. Now I want to see. How bad of a monster can we make? Let's do one more. We'll do a male character. There we go. A uh, uh, male character. Which is the funniest looking face that we can destroy? Dude, that's like exactly the hair that What's His Face has from Dune. Yes, fat old man. Fat old bald man. What the hell? Dude, what the? He looks like. Oh my god, he looks exactly like Zach Galifianakis here. Ew, he looks like a super villain. All right, here we go. Yo, he's got his body's fucking a ten though. All right, height. 
We can make him a, a just a little guy, you know? Okay, there we go. Torso length. What looks better? Long? Oh. <laughs> I think short torso would look maybe better. Muscle type. Okay. I wish you could make him more ripped. It's annoying you can't. Muscle strength. The definition of the muscles? Okay. Why can't I have that body with the abs, but on on Bonnie? Okay, let's see. Muscle mass on the legs. Oh my god. He got that beer gut though. Listen, that's just that's all power, right? That's all strength. Okay, that's good. That's good. Every all right, now we're cooking. We cooking now. He looks like a toad. Head. <laughs> head length. I wanted to have a really long hole. That's a little bean of a head, man. What happened to you, dog? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna be honest. It's his head is so thin, I can't tell the difference. All right, there we go. Why well, making you and yeah, this is fighter PL. <laughs> My man's got that beard gut. Look at him. I'm telling you, that's just all power. He he built like a toad. Oh, we can make his neck even. Oh, I wish we could make his neck longer. Okay, that's good. Upper body. Shoulder width? Big. Shoulder size? Huge. Chest thickness? It makes his, his body... Oh my lord. There we go. Chest size? Small. We'll make it small. Torso width? Yes, please. Torso depth? Oh, even wider. Arm length? Or max? <laughs> Law, thank you for the 34 months, man. What is it? Is this game good? The main game was good, yeah. It comes out, uh, I think, in like a week and a half on the 22nd. This reminds me, I want to change where we have him. There we go. He's just like a creature you find out in the, in the wild. Is there a way to toggle so I get rid of all this shit on the screen? Reset camera, rotate camera up and down. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Okay, I think he looks better here where we're working on. We can really pay attention. No invasions, any co op? No, no invasions, no co op. Alright, arm size. We are making him kind of beefy. Look at that beefcake. We'll make his forearms thin, as thin as they go. Lower body. Waist. Yes, thin. Waist size. Small. 
his rear size that's his max by the way that's his rear size at 100 percent we're giving him a negative ass leg size overall thin calf size can i give him big calves but thin uh maybe we'll give him thin everything Yo, that girl you like, she's gonna pull up with this guy and be like, yo, this is this is him who I've been talking to. This is the the Chad. This dude steals your girl. Don't get that shit wrong, alright? Vultures, thank you for the 43 long month sub. Ca cash wheels with the six month sub. You guys think he looks like Gru? We had multiple people say that actually. Gru Gru's this thick? Gru's kinda hot. His posture. I want him to have perfect posture. There we go. His knees. He walks with a with a purpose. No, he walks with a porpoise. There we go. Imagine seeing this shit walking towards you at 3 a.m. How afraid would you be? Because I would be deathly afraid. Mortified, even. I'd be so scared. Okay. We're done with his body. Wow, that was just his body. Oh my god, he becomes handsome, too. This is when he uses the face filters and he does TikToks with his face filter. So when he does TikToks, he looks like this, right? But then his actual face is like that. But when he does TikToks... This is what he uses to, to try to get money and and he, this is the picture he has on his Tinder. But that's him when he arrives in person. He goes, sup, babe. Nice to finally meet you. It's me, uh, Boinklin. Okay, we like, I like his head. Skin. I feel like you can almost see more of his his wrinkles with this. Like this is like an older skin. <laughs> I kind of like that one. <laughs> can I use this? But like, is there an older version of that? Oh, oh, we can make him just pale as a ghost. Oh. I think that looks the worst. It means literally pale as a ghost. Okay, we'll do that one. Ew, it makes his, his nipples look orange. Wrinkles max skin sheen. Ah, he's oily too. Ah, look at the sheen on him. He's freshly bathed. All right, his brows. He looks like a Resident Evil villain, to be honest. Okay, that's... Actually, let's do... There we go. That looks good. There we go. Depth. No, I want to see the humanity in his eyes. Angle. Oh, he almost looks sad. Oh, oh, that's what I think when I see him. I go, oh, isn't he cute? See, guys, don't you guys think he's cute? Okay, low eyes. <laughs> Definitely a low eyes. Uh, Key still, thank you for the 47 long month sub, man. Crazy, four years, unbelievable. And I appreciate the long time support. It's Sam, thank you as well for the 25 long month sub. The width of his eyes. I like the wide more. 
We'll give him normal, normal-ish eyes. There we go. Like almost enough that if you don't really pay attention, you won't notice him. Okay, we'll do... Okay, we'll keep his eyes sort of straight. Sort of angled down. <laughs> his left eye stopped working. Wait, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> A little squint in his left eye and his right eye closed and it will... It will not open, dude. It has... It just stopped working. Holy shit. I gotta like that. Just his eye just this stopped working. Oh my god, we're barely at the nose. Alright. That's good. Man, this is what I'm gonna look like in fucking twelve years, so you know, better get used to it, chat. You guys, you know what? You better say his fucking rhino nose that I just gave him is cute. Because this is what I'm going to look like in 12 years, guaranteed. Nostril height. Low or high? Oh, that looks way... Oh my fucking god. If he goes in the water for a second, he drowns. All the water will get in his nose. He cannot plug that shit. That's that's a wild ass nose. That nose is kind of crazy. That <laughs> that's the worst nose in history. He does that thing where, you know, in cartoons where they can smell a pie and it leads them to the pie. He can do that for real in real life. Ears. Or should we do little ears? His ears being turned in like that. He, has, he looks like a pig. Okay, we do that. He looks too pig-like. That's fucking wild. <laughs> His earlobes are failing him. Look at those lobes. Somehow he has sagging lobes. Cyber Mage, thank you so much for the 13 months. I appreciate that very, very much, dude. Thank you. You can use tattoos to change his full skin color to blue. Oh, that's interesting. Ew, we get all oh, we gave him like sharp ears. I want her to be sharp enough that they he's not a mystical creature, he's just odd. Ew, I would be sickened if I played as this character. I just wanted to make a character that looked... Like, I wanted to see how how far we can oh. go, you know? He actually looks swollen. Neck thickness? That's good. <laughs> good. We've destroyed a character. Oh my god. Again, I'm gonna look exactly like this in maybe 11 years. So I better get used to it. Just as oily too. It looks better low. I think high looks better. There you go, that looks good. <laughs> okay, little mouth looks better. Mouth protrusion. That's good. 
I brought this creature into existence. Now you must play with him. Hell no. Oh, uh, nobody would watch this run. <laughs> See, he's got a little smile. Guys, a little smile. And he has an underbite. Actually, this is kind of wild. What a character. I want to take a picture of this shit. I wish I could make the things on the side that say like zoom and all that like disappear. No. Wait. No, 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 no. I want to take a picture of this. What do you guys think out of 10? Does he look hot? I feel like if I had to give my character here a rating, it would almost certainly be a, uh, maybe an 11. I don't know that like 10, 11. This, this character created for Dragon's Dogma 2 is, uh, is is something again i'm gonna look exactly like this in in maybe five years so you know say he's cute say he's cute chat because i won't be able to take it otherwise nine out of ten oh that's pretty good right, i'll take a picture of him this one's for the insta I also took that I was when I was talking, I was taking a video. I might post that some maybe we'll post it on TikTok or a, a YouTube short. <laughs> Alright, what are we what are we working on? His cheeks? We just finished his cheek, his mouth. His lip thickness is 69, by the way. Nice. Demetrius, thank you for the 15 months, man. And good morning. Can't stay and need to work. Hey, hopefully you have a good day at work. I appreciate you stopping by for a moment to, to drop a sub. Thank you. His chin and jaw. I, I wanted to make his t his neck real tiny, but. All right, his jaw definition. A real defined jaw. There you go. Chin width. Okay, we we did kind of give him a thin head, so we, I forgot we got to keep doing that. Whatever makes his head look thinner. That's the thinnest head ever. That's what she said. Chin sharpness. Which one of them? Okay, I like that. Hairstyle. You know what's crazy? The whole time we've been working with this hairstyle and I feel like it's perfect. <laughs> oh my god. Should we give him like a cool modern like hip hairstyle? Like you see him from behind and people go like, oh shit. Hey yo, damn! Hey, he's he's kind of hot, huh? Should we go? Should we go talk to him at a bar or something? Oh, I'm kind of nervous. He looks too hot. Uh, and they hit him. They tap him on the shoulder. Like, excuse me, sir. Yes. Uh. Although I I love the bald. The bald I think looks perfect. It looks perfect for what we were making and what we were, what we're going for in life, you know? What about the other bald one? Because we have two. We have this one. We have the one where he's bald but has slightly longer hair. A fade? 
I don't know why that accentuates his eyebrows. Completely bald? I like balding. There's something about the black hair too. <laughs> White hair, blonde hair. black and then maybe the tip like his hair is getting white because he's he's getting he's getting up there in age you know oh my god like somehow that hair just does not go away and it will not be bald i love by the way that this is the character we've taken the longest on so far out of all the characters we've done he is kind of a humdrum little lad Eyebrows? Ooh! I like those. <laughs> no eyebrows! Oh no! I kind of like that. <laughs> ah. It has to be black. I like I. It has to be accentuated, you know. We got to be able to see the eyebrows, even though the gold one made me laugh. Super thick too. What do you think, thin or thick? Oh, it has to be thick. There you go. It's got to be thick. Facial hair. Oh. Oh my God. Look at how much work that beard is doing, by the way. Like, he almost doesn't look... He obviously looks crazy, right? But he almost doesn't look half bad with the beard. Look at how much work that thing is putting on. Like, I could almost see him with somebody with that beard. And this, he just looks like a Viking, you know? This is your average Viking. It'd be funny to catch him in the process of trying to grow a beard, though. Oh, mustache! Oh, mustache! Oh, mutton chops! I think we gotta give him mutton chops. Yes! Mutton chops! That looks great! <laughs> Graying mutton chops. Oh my god. Oh no, body hair. Oh! Oh! Oh, dude, he's got a snail trail. I don't know. I, I, I think no body hair looks better. Hairy arms and legs, but he shaves his chest. What do you guys think? I kind of like that one. I think that's the best. But then, oh my god, the density of it. Can we turn it a different color? We can give him white. All his body hair grows white. Okay, I think that looks good. Holy shit, dude. That's wild. What a beast. Yeah, his chest is easily his best feature, you know? This is, a, this is the feature he's the most proud of. Hey, say what you will. <laughs> you know, he's got a six-pack, so... Oh, yeah, we can edit his one eye. 
Should we make it milky? It's going milky. I kind of want to give him beautiful blue eyes, to be honest. Like, almost like Gojo's eyes. Okay. Iris primary, Iris secondary. Okay, there we go. Like, if things would have gone a different direction in his life, he would have had the most beautiful eyes ever. What the fuck is a slurella? Oh, the outside of it. I see. That looks good. He's got that, that Gojo Riz. There you go. Eyelashes. Okay, we keep his eyelashes black and, and long, long and thick. Oh no. Eyeshadow. That's just the discoloration in his eyes. Okay, we won't give him any eyeshadow, but I will give him eyeliner. Uh, any of these look good? Mm, that one kind of looks okay. It looks weird. Which is, I guess, what we want. There you go. Freckles? I think that's good. We'll give him some freckles. My man's got some freckles. Cheek opacity for what? The freckles? Oh, that. Whatever the hell that is. Oh, we can make him blush. Oh, it, it makes it look metallic. Make it... Ew. <laughs> oh, no. Ooh, look, his cheeks are blushy because you told him he's cute. I kind of like that one. It really fucks up his face even more. Lip color? There you go. Like, there's something wrong with them, you know? There we go. Oh, okay, we're definitely taking a couple of his teeth off. You can't even see his bottom lip. <laughs> <laughs> he just has his top teeth. <laughs> ah, holy shit, man. What have what have we done? Alright, we definitely can't give him any tattoos in his body. Again, his body is his best feature. I, I kind of want to give him a sleeve. But a bad one. What is that? Is that an arrow? Keep that one in mind. Just some shit on his arm. 
That's when he tried to get a free tattoo, and then they were like, no, we don't give out free tattoos. So what he did was he quickly grabbed some tattoo ink and rubbed it on his arm and then ran out. And they could not catch him because, surprisingly, my man runs at 38 miles an hour. I will do that. Okay, I kind of like that. Let me see. Scars. Body scars. Let me see real quick. Holy shit. Oh, what happened to him? No, I want him. Ew. Should we give him a big ass scar like this or leave him leave his stomach untouched? I kind of want to leave him untouched. Could I give him a scar but put it in around his neck? Oh my, how did he not die? Straight up. Yeah, how's he even alive at, at that point, you know? Look at the sheen on that scar, though. All right, we'll give him no scar. We'll make him a little dirty, though. <laughs> oh, God. Just a little bit of soot on him, you know? Some dirt. He's, he was playing in the mud. Leave him alone. He's a dirty boy. He was playing in the mud. That's good. Is that it? Oh my god. There he is. Holy hell. Wow. Wow. He's 100% a fighter. His voice. That what a demonic ass voice. That armor is kind of wild though. Look how much it stretches. Imagine how much money they waste on that plating. Okay, I like that one. There he is. His name is going to be... Uh... Bartholomew. Bartholomew. Oh, there we go. And his nickname... His moniker, Chad. There he is, ladies and gentlemen, Bartholomew. <sighs> wow. What do you mean he's a fake Chad? He's a real goddamn Chad. Yes. Uh, ha ha, we created some beauties. On, the character creator for this game is amazing. I want to see, can I see where they are? I want to see my my babies. Oh, there he is. And then we have Bonnie that we made earlier, who's pretty hot. What a creature, though. Fuck me. I kind of want to play as him, though. Damn it. We'll see. I don't know. We'll see what we do, right? That would be awesome if I can maybe save him and make him a... I can make him one of my companions. That would be cool. Maybe we can do that. When does the game come out? It comes out on the 22nd. So not too long now, in a couple weeks. And then we will be able to see these characters in action.
All right, though. I think uh, I think we'll leave it there. Did a couple hours of some character creator. Did uh, did a little bit of uh, the the climbing game, which were were both very fun. But thank you all so much for coming out to the stream. Did I see the cursed Pikachu? No, but I did see a lot of character creators that people made, and I mean, some of the characters people made were were freaking amazing. And this will probably be a video, and I'm going to tell people to send me more of their characters. Maybe we'll do a compilation of the best characters before the game comes out. We'll see. Anyways, I appreciate you guys hanging out. Thank you guys on both YouTube and Twitch. Thank you to all the subs, the donations, the followers, the members. Uh, I appreciate it very, very much for everybody on YouTube. Before you head out, if you could leave a like on the live stream. It always helps out the, the video and stuff whenever it goes live. But thank you all. Have yourselves a wonderful rest of your day. If I stream tomorrow, then I'll be here. And uh, we'll see what we play. But have yourselves a good one. See you all in the next one. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye-bye.